The Scuola Superior di Studi Storici di San Moreno, founded in 1988 is a doctorate awarding center for research and study in history and related humanities, with a strong international character. Historical background The Scuola Superior di Studi Storici was inaugurated with a public lecture by Eugenio Garon on 30 September 1989 in the presence of Federico Mayer. Zaragoza, UNESCO General Director, and Faust R. Morgenthai, San Marino Secretary of State for Public and Higher Education and Culture. Garin's lecture, entitled Polibio e Machiavelli, was subsequently edited by Gemma Cavallari in July 1990 and published by the San Marino Ministry of State for Higher and Public Education and Culture. The lecture text has since been republished by the Italian Turin-based publisher Inaudi, together with the introductory essay to the text of History Fiorentine reprinted from the Lemonier 1857 edition. Organization the Scuola is administratively responsible to the Department of Historical Studies within the University of the Republic of San Moreno, whose first enactment the Scuola's inauguration was. Its principal activity is a triennial doctoral program which has represented from its inception in 1989 one of Europe's most innovative experiments. In this field, the doctorate in historical studies is unusual in the level of interdisciplinary instruction offered to students. A distinguished Consiglio Scientifico or Academic Council, recruited from Italy and beyond, is intended to ensure the strength and breadth of this interdisciplinarity, particularly in history and other humanities. Doctoral program. Doctoral students attending the Scuola, some of whom are awarded full funding in the form of a borsa or scholarship on entry, have been drawn mainly from Italy and occasionally from San Marino itself, but a very substantial minority have come from other countries all over the world. During the first two years of each triennial cycle students attend intensive series of lectures delivered on historical and related academic disciplines delivered by a similarly international range of distinguished academics. At the same time they research and write their doctoral theses, which from the third year of the cycle becomes their sole academic focus. The Scuola recognizes three official languages, Italian, English and French, and will accept theses written in any of the three. Students' doctoral supervisors are usually academics from other universities appointed as visiting staff for the purpose. The degree is awarded on the basis of the thesis and of Eva Voce examination. The first three triennial cycles ran from 1989 to 1995. After a hiatus the series resumed in 1999. Directors The Scuola has had two directors, both Italian ancient historians and public intellectuals. Aldo Schiavoni and Luciano Canfora, faculty and professors. All the academics making up the scientific committee give lectures at the Scuola as well as invited external scholars. Among others, the Scuola has hosted, mostly on a regular basis, Giuseppe Alberigo, Etienne Balabar, Aremo Baudet, Lucio Gambi, Jacques Le Goff. Jacques Revel, Ruggiero Romano, Nicola Tranfaglia, Valerio Castronovo, Umberto Eco, Andrea Giardina, Eric Hobsbawm, Michael Crawford, Michel Corinman, Charles S. Mayer, Giacomo Maramau, Nicola Matucci, Anthony Molho, Wolfgang Momsen, Romano Prada, Adriano Prospera, Ezio Raimondi, Paolo Rossi. Silvia Ronchi, Corrado Vivanti, Bridget Mondrain, Pier Paolo Portinaro, Nicola Labanca, Pierre Levesque, Evelyn Patlagian, Chiara Frugoni, Eva Cantrella, Carlo Ginsberg, Ivano Dianigi, Carlo Osola, Salvo Mastalone, Aldo Agosti, Marco Revelli, Pietro Scopola, Alberto Bergio. Enzo Carlotti, Armando Petrucci, Domenico Loja, Ramon T. Giacagiso, Santiago Montero Herrero, Paolo Luigi Branca, Andre Vorchez, Tulio Gregory, 
Angelo Panabianco, Giovanna Davario Rocchi, Giovanni Levi, Franco Farinelli, Giuliana Gemelli, Furio Diaz, Giuseppe Nancy, Alan Boro, Michel Sott, Raimondo Luraghi and Robert Nation. Alumni, among those who have studied and received their doctorates at the school of the following have attained eminence in their fields. Jan Krzysztof Olenki, formerly Polish Minister of Culture and since 2008 Poland's ambassador to Tunisia, French historian of ideas and social commentator, Marie Judith Revel, Italian historian of the French Revolution and of the myth of Padre Pio. Sergio Luzzatto, and local politician Antonio Natalicio, mayor of Giovanazzo in Apulia. Young Collection Exhibition at the Salone Internazionale del Libro 2010. In 2010 at the International Book Show in Turin, Italy, San Marino University Library exhibited the most precious volumes from the Young Collection, the richest collection of works on memory and mnemotechnics in the world. The Young Collection is conserved in the University Library in San Moreno. It includes 197 books from the 19th century as well as 11 incunabula, almost 2,000 monographs of later date. 2,000 articles, 500 prints, illustrations and artifacts, and other materials relating to memory and memorization. 20th Anniversary On February 27, 2009, the 20th anniversary from the Scuola Foundation was celebrated in the presence of the Excellentissima Capitani Regenti della Repubblica di San Marino. The celebration was presided over by Luciano Canfora and included three lectures by Maurice Mardon, I Territori e I Tempi della Storia Oggi, Giuseppe Galassuan, Storicism e Identity Europea, and Adriano Prospero on L'ETA del Disciplinamento, Un Bilancio, Positive Assessment. On 5 July 2009, one of the most influential columnists on the Italian newspaper Corriere della Sera, historian, and former Italian ambassador to Moscow, Sergio Romano, wrote an article in praise of the University of San Marino and specifically describing the scuola as una excellente scuola di alta studi frequentata da ottimi studio c.